Hallihallo everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Starcrawlers. We are Trangers of um, Alessa and the crew. Um, we just finished the mission in the mines and um, I also had to level up one for Vectra and I gave her the timed release which um, yeah, gives uh, one of her um, allies um, regeneration on her turn. The one with the lowest health, always good. And the prototype got target lock, which means um, it becomes obsessed with um, its target and can, can do more damage to that one. I think that's very good for um, bosses and things like that. Uh, I also, oh wait, I also got um, two things to um, auction. <coughs> Sorry, I had uh, two things I could auction away, and I got those two things. One is the boomslang like armor of the void, which, um, yeah, it's not so good, but I think I will give it to Vectra. Okay, I could zero use it. No, I give it to Vectra. Although that one is also pretty good, what we see has, because um, I just need to upgrade it. It's more or less the same. Over oh, this is the battle scanner, which gives them more experience, and I think that's pretty good. And um, yeah, it's the experience here. Yeah, gets more experience from this one. And she wears this one with me when I upgrade it, which which I'm going to do. And I have this um, Voip Psychers Boom Slang light armor, which is actually ideal for zero. But, um, yeah, he loses a lot of stuff, and even if I uh, would equip, um, upgrade it, I don't think it would um, bring much, although I can take a look. Yeah, blocks two damage, and I... And, uh, Void Psychers Madness number one. Requires Void Psyker. When combat begins, our enemies have a 5% chance to be confused for one turn. And Boomslang Armor increased critical strike by 5%, yeah. He already has something better. He has kin kin Kinetic Radiant to 2, which means he gets... Um, his armor gets 2 maneuver, immediately reducing the time units on a successful dodge, which means if he dodges, he comes... Um, his turn um, is uh, sooner. He becomes faster. And he can still crit uh, has um, critical chances. Five percent for three turns, and he also gets void shielding, which means he gets void resistance. So I will upgrade just this for um, Vectra, for more experience, for increase of critical strike, and also for some void shielding. It costs a little, but it's not much. So let's give it to her. And I will sell the old ones. I also want to go back to the black market and... Let's see. What do I want? Do I want another weapon crate, shield crate or armor crate? I want a new weapon. Let's see what you can give me. Those things are always random, so I don't know what I'm getting. Wow, Hacker's Fox King Touchy of Toxicity. A rare like melee weapon. Could Zero use it? Oh yeah, he can use it. Hacker's Jailbreak. Wait, it's a weapon for Hackers? Yeah, Hacker Straight Black requires Hacker each turn. The viruses have a 20% chance to boost duration by one and immediately update. Wow. Fox can written. On weapon crit, cost of next action is reduced by 5 time unit stacks. Wow. Weapon. And weapon deals chemical damage. Wow, I give it to Vectra. So our Hacker got some serious upgrades. And I love it. 
So I will know service to her. And just open the stash. I want to take a long arm. Let's see. Um, what do I want? Yeah, just two of those for just in case. We need more than metal supplies. And check the job board. Okay. Let's do the black box mission, which is the um, story mission. Employee, Aurora Starliners. Investigation. Danger rating easy. Judicious level 3. Okay, we are even 4. Aurora Starliners wants intel on what happened on, on the Stellar Marine. Since you uncovered the coordinates, we would like to you to retrieve a black box from the NAV Bay located on deck 105. Locate and return it intact. The ship is on lockdown. No one's allowed in or out under UFP con council ruling. So the mission is strictly dark ops. Very nice. We get some nice EXP, we get some nice money and better reputation with Aurora, but hmm, that's not so important, but we are still going to do it. We take the whole team along. Fast psychers hail from the monastery girl, monastery home ship Geduld. Oh yeah, that's Alessa, where Alessa comes from. Ball string on across. Yeah, we will now do a story mission. Let's see if we find some very nice things. And after that, I will do another one or two side missions. Welcome to Repair. Picture as Stella Marine, I guess. This is deck 110. According to the direction of from Aurora, you want to head over to the commercial plaza and then the, an elevator right down to 105 from the nearest nav chamber and a black box. Easy as pie. Sounds simple enough. Got two calls waiting for you from Horizon Robotics and Walkers United for a hush hush mission. There's a lot of people up in your, our business. A thousand flies buzz around in the airing cuff and the spider watches all. What do I want? Both are proposing a quick job while you're already up board. Decent pay off but so who would you like to talk first? Whoa. Okay. First, um, Walkers United. Sure thing, patching them in now. Luna's face is replaced by a dark screen. The voice that addresses you is not nuanced. Is nuanced and charismatic, like an old word politician. Oh dear lord. Apparently she is not big on whole chat. Hello there. I represent Rockers United. We are a civilian group focused on protecting the rights of individuals. Oh, it sounds nice. And what can I do for Rockers United? Uh, one moment. Okay. I have a proposal for you. I need the black box data you've been hired to obtain. We want the raw data, not whatever's left over after Corp PR finishes the hatchet job. Forward as a copy for handing it over and we'll consider you a paid debt. Your debt paid. My debt? Why yes, your debt. As you took the liberty of stealing medical supplies bound to break the colony and selling them, we assume you wish to make amends for and pay your debt. I didn't sell any supplies. The clip tone of a workers united rep takes an air of menace. You did sell supplies. Your pilot Luna arranged for their sell on station terminus 9. Don't insult my intelligence and waste our time playing dumb. Okay, how did you know about this? We have eyes everywhere. The common worker is oppressed by the corporate machines. You would do well remember that when considering to steal from the future. But I digress. Will you transmit the black box data to us and clear your debt? I think think carefully before you respond. Well Ah, eh, they sound very ominous, I must say. I mean okay they stand, they say they stand up for a small man, but um that is very ominous and I don't have really a debt to anyone. Ah, sorry. 
It's not going to happen. I'm under contract with another party. A deal's a deal. Keep in mind that you'll be, you be doing a great service to the families of a missing colonist. Don't you think that we deserve to know the truth? Mm. Yeah, the big problem is we don't know if I really want to give it to them. And and games like this, every corporation is kind of shady. Uh, but let's make an exception. I guess I can make an exception for a good cause. Or maybe it's not my responsibility to give it to them. Mm. Yeah, but they don't really pay me anything, so... Uh, I don't want no more enemies. Okay. That's excellent news. With your help, maybe we can discover what happened there. I will leave it to you. Robert Cops cuts off a call. Patching in a second call. The whole display darkens momentarily, then flickers back on, revealing a flash looking cop mouthpiece with an oily grin. I don't like him. You can almost taste the insincere wings about, the, about to be directed in your way. Hey there, partner. My employee has a little favor to us. Aurora is determined to get their hands on that black box, but the intel really ought to be going to Horizon first. As the unofficial UFP leader, we have a responsibility to make sure all evidence is handled properly. Um, sounds like something you should take up on up with Aurora. Well, no, sometimes it's easier to come at the thing sideways rather than start a confrontation. All we need is a copy of the data just to make sure it's not tampered with. You can still take the box to Aurora afterwards and will be none the wiser. Aurora said transmitting the data might co cause corruption. Yeah, let's talk about that. Sounds like a scare tactic to me. Those boxes are made to withstand just about anything. Send the data our way and we, you will be 300 credits richer and no one will ever know except for the two of us. Mm. Oh, I could tell, tell our, hacker, our hacker some intel and in saying, yeah, doing that could <coughs> destroy their data, which means we are not getting paid, so we have to carve out more. But no dice, I'm on a job, I intend to complete it as directed. The horizon gives you a wide smile, but his grey gaze is flat and reptilian. Let's not be hasty, friend. Getting the wrong side of horizon robotics is not the way for a new crawler to get started with this. You think on that while you're run wandering around. When you get to that box, I'm sure you will make the right choice. Free in the credits for a simple transmission. Seems like the services are in demand today. There's hoping that walks out to my advantage. Human agendas, conflicting goals may collide. More risk, more rewards. Uh, let's find the gold box and get paid. Yeah, it's one thing um, doing that thing for Workers United to get them off um, my butt. But. Um, but UFP thing? No, I don't want to be constricted in bigger corrupt conspiracies or whatever. Or some corruption and stuff like that. At least not now. Who? Trash can. I will take everything with me except when I want to throw it away for better things. Any crit sticks here? It doesn't seem so. Mm, maybe I should have declined both of us. Aurora security door. An Aurora Starline security door of Basia Path. The security on these doors. Ah, uh, it's top notch. We will have difficult time cracking it without the access badge. Um, then let's leave it alone for now. Uh, 
I'm just worried because nothing tried to kill us. And aren't there more cred sticks or anything? No, doesn't seem so. You emerge into white inviting halls of posh residential era. The upper decks clearly house with affluent a cleaning house with affluent passengers. A waiter boat is idling nearby and turns as we enter, waving an oddly cheering greeting. Domestic helper in ferry programming, yet it made no things. Classy dicks means, uh, means classy booze. Shall we start with scroll off an aperitif? We are all likely doomed. Seek refuge in liquid solace. Okay. Oh, waiter. A waiter who tries to kill us. Who <coughs> use your new blade? 41 chemical damage. Uh, 31. That's very nice. And what's this? A generation. Yeah, that one is re isn't really a problem. Sorry, I had to drink something. Yeah, that didn't really help with any XP. Your team still stares in silence at the domed robot. Am I hallucinating or did we just get attacked by a raider bot? This man of automatum is not even programmed for combat, for combat correct? Call Luna and report the attack. You sure have laughed to laugh chatting with me, don't you? What's up? We have been aggressed by one of the servant automatons. I believe this merits an adjustment in a reward. The service in this place is terrible. I'll ping Doc to get on the wire to our on the wire to Aurora. I wouldn't mind if they tossed a, a little extra hazard pay away. Please take care up there. Relaxing in the shuttle truly a hazard. Oh, that was the prototype. Depends on your definition of a hazard. Your impending, de your impending demise is my un impending unemployment. Just looking out for what's been, for what's best for the team. Okay, we will watch for more hostile hostiles. Well, that's escalated quickly. Actually, not very quickly. And I sadly cannot do anything with this. Nothing here. Not even a cred stick or anything. That, that's a shame. I don't want to leave this room yet. But looks very nice here. This looks very comfy. Is there anything more? Nothing to plunder, nothing where I can take something with me. Hey, what is this? This is nothing. Oh, that's really a shame. Okay, let's go there first. A figure emerged clumsily from behind a bulkhead, waving his hands to get your attention. His suit's logos indicate he works for W. Yutaki. Oh, W. Yutaki employee. Don't shoot. I'm not armed. I'm glad you're not you're not one of the, those psychotic waiter bots. Replace your meat suit. Upgrade your immortal steel. Sooner the better. Ah, uh, right. Listen. I'm in a real bind and you look capable. Capable. Maybe you could help me out. There's an easy cre there's easy credits in for you. You're supposed to be in lockdown. What are you doing here? Respectfully, what are you doing he here? We both know that corps play by their own rules. I'm just trying to capitalize on their interests, same as you. Plus, when W. Yutaki says, says jump, you don't ask why. So a boat was credits. Right. W. Yutaki sent me in, sent me in to locate an ex-employee's holotop. We have intel that he was recruiting for workers in United and want to get a copy of his recruitment files. Oh, really? You 
glanced around me nervously. I expected an empty ship, but I have been hiding from bots since I walked in. I am not geared for this, but if you can locate the files and via me a copy, I will pay 50 credits for each file you send. Vectra. I am betting those files will be heavily encrypted. 50 credits barely covers my consulting fee. Yes, can we get more? Yeah, damn. Okay, I'm not risking getting W. Yutaki Piss. The guy's resistance should be in this ring. His name, his name's Herman Dorfel. Here's a wire address. Send any workers, un uh, send any workers united files you find, and I'll pay 100 credits per file. Either way, I'm out of hell hellhole right now. Nice doing business with you. And with that, our time's over. And we got another deal, which is awesome. So, um, yeah, it seems we will have to do a lot of more stuff here. And this nice, nice ship with psychotic waiter robots. How this will, will this end? I don't know. But what I know is next time we are continuing with the game. And also with this mission, as, well, we don't have a choice, we are in the middle of it. Anyway. I hope you enjoyed it, I really did, and goodbye and have a nice day. See you next time.